what is one of your most gratifying experience so far as a sexologist? What is one of your most gratifying experience as a sexologist? Hi, my name is Martha. I'm a clinical sexologist with a doctorate in human sexuality. And I am from Arrows Coaching. That's EROSCoaching.com. Okay, so in my work uh, as a sexologist, there are many things that I do. I make videos like this. I come up with my own online training programs. I see clients, I give talks, and I also run my own workshops. So in my work, I would say in the last seven years, I've probably worked with about 400 couples um, who uh, cannot consummate their marriage, cannot have sex, um, and or um, have vaginismus. So vaginismus is a condition that happens when a woman's vagina shuts down, making penetration difficult or impossible. I talk about this a lot because I want as many people to know about this as possible so that they don't suffer and that they don't have to continue feeling that there's no help uh, for their condition. So when it comes to most gratifying experiences, it has to be um, working face to face with people because then that's when you really see uh, results and uh, it's very different from people reading a book attending a workshop even though there's a lot of transformation that can happen in the workshop however it's in doing the face to face that a lot of people feel safe and a lot of people feel that they can ask whatever questions that they want um, at the pace that they want so as a sexologist being able to work with clients seeing them having aha moments, having their faces light up with understanding, with illumination. Uh, you can actually literally feel the um, energy that they have, you know, uh, coming back to them. So by that, I mean like they might come in first with like negativity, with hopelessness, with despair, with um, really like a lot of questioning like what they could do or what could be done about that situation. And by the end of the session, to have real understanding of um, their issue in a way that has never been explained to them. And then being able to understand what are the steps they can do to have improvement, to start to feel better. So this power that they have, this empowerment, this light that comes upon them, um, their faces and even the, the physique, uh, is something that does happen and can happen uh, even in one session. And that's what I live for. That's what I live for. Uh, as an as a educator, the lack of information and knowledge uh, does so much to us. And it, uh, it leads to a lot of suffering. And um, I, I just love being able to help people um, to be able to attain that level of freedom. And um, it is definitely much more effective when you work with people one-to-one -one because, um, uh, and I really love when I can work with them face-to-face -face as well because then I can not just hear what they're saying, I can see what is happening in their body physically, energetically. And I can also sense the emotions um, that they have behind the words that they say much more easily if I can see them. So I feel that I, I am doing uh, what I was taught that all counsellors should be doing, which is not just here. You have to see, you have to sense, you have to look at the meaning behind the words and the emotions behind it, which I feel that um, I got uh, after, I would say, the first year of my practice, at, at the very least. Um, I really, really got it. And um, through the years, the experience that I have has helped me to uh, fine-tune this. I feel I am able to pick up on whatever little clients share so much quickly um, because of the experience that I've had. So anyway, I'm just saying like this is, this is what I live for. The time that I have with clients uh, is just so precious because there's so much uh, good that can be done even in one session and um, I have clients who uh, for financial reasons um, they are quite pragmatic they may not want to have more sessions so I do feel uh, an element of pressure 
So every time I have a session with a client, an opportunity to have someone in session, uh, I do my best. I give my 101%, like I literally give all of myself. I make sure that I'm rested. I make sure that I, I am in a good place, that I'm grounded, that I'm, uh, I, I, I clear uh, whatever stuff is going on in my uh, personal life and I really stay true to what is it that they are looking for for that session and I do everything that I can to help them, to explain to them so that they can have the illumination that I love. So that's very, very gratifying for me. So this is Martha of Arrows Coaching uh, sharing with you um, what a little bit of what it's been like working as a sexologist. So if you have any questions, um, you can always uh, post a comment below and you can also email me at ask at arrowscoaching.com.